We're at a dairy now that's a scrape dairy, so they use a lot of wheat straw for bedding to keep the cows dry and warm during the winter, and they'll put it out in their shades. And uh, it's, it's pretty when it's out there. It's clean, the cows enjoy it. And after about two or three days, they'll need to take it off. So then they'll bring that straw here to the site on the dairy. And what they'll do is they'll begin to compost it. As you see going on in the distance behind us, this is a big compost turner. And that mixes the manure and the straw and the liquids, which generate heat. When you mix that carbon and nitrogen together with oxygen and moisture, it creates heat, which breaks the straw down. So it is a composting process, and the steam is rising up off of it because it's hot in there. It'll get up to, again, we want to get it up to the 140 degree range to kill the pathogens. So what we're doing with the product here has two options when we finish. One, if the dairy decides they want to keep it, we'll put it in an area and save it for bedding for the cows for next year. Or if the dairy says, we have more than we need for bedding, can you guys from organics sell this? So then we'll take an analysis of this, send it off to a soil lab, and when it comes back, we will match the, the analysis of the product with our end user, whether it's a potato farmer, a hop farmer. It's usually for agricultural uses. And then we'll load it on a truck and about 20,000 yards of product leave here to go to one customer. So we're excited about the fact that the dairy has decided to buy straw for bedding. Because the dairyman here says, if I make enough money off of the sale of the compost just to buy straw, I'll buy straw to do my bedding, we'll compost it, and you guys ship it out of here, I'll make money, I'll buy straw for next year. So he looks at it as an income source to now buy bedding to keep his cows healthy. We look at it as a great product that we're able to take on the dairy site that was a byproduct for them, turn it into that value add product and afford to put it on trucks and send it up to 50, 60 miles away to agricultural use.